we are all getting to a common agreement that the psychosocial needs of people living with HIV and quality of life is, is a priority. And this is also involving stigma and discrimination. The main priority for a person living with HIV is to find a space to talk about what they are worried about, really worried about, because uh, now that we have a good treatment and HIV is really well controlled, they need to go further. We've had some people living with HIV when they get more information and they knew that there are new treatments, they are the ones going to the, the HIV specialist and say, okay, I'm okay with the, this treatment, but maybe I want to change. There is still a lot of challenge to face, a lot of more knowledge about sexuality, but also uh, about HIV and how is HIV nowadays. So for instance, uh, some people living with HIV, they found uh, walls in the in the healthcare system. It's a sign that they open openly say that they have HIV, or even if they go to the dentist, uh, they sometimes are moved uh, at the end of the of the queue because the dentist thinks that they they had to be treated in a different way. It's not only a problem of being treated in a different way, but also a problem of not getting the same health rights, which is uh, even crazier. At the end of the day, if a person that is living something that clinically is controlled but is suffering in the society because of just a virus, that person is not going to take care enough of themselves if we don't help them, if we don't give them a more secure places uh, with more empathy, with more compassion and with more understanding. What I see is that people get more strength to be visible which is something that was more difficult in the past. So when they see that there is life farther than just the virus and the clinical aspect of the, of the virus, and they see this network of support around and got this message of seeing more than just HIV. I see how this way of thinking and this support is changing lives. So I see future, I see the end of HIV, I see quality of life, I see respect, compassion and rights and I see happy people when I think uh, maybe HIV is not the thing that they are going to think every single morning when they wake up.